I'm Andrew Edwards, and you're watching Gear Live. Huawei's new MateBook 13 poses some serious competition to other laptops. If you're a Windows user or are simply looking for a MacBook-like experience on the cheap, the $999 MacBook 13 may be a good option for you. What is going on, Tech Squad? Andrew Edwards here, editor of GearLife.com. If you're into tech and gadgets, feel free to hit the subscribe button down below along with the bell notification icon so you don't miss any future videos. As I mentioned today, we are talking about Huawei's MateBook 13. If you haven't heard of it, I'm gonna give you the top five features to what makes it stand out to me. Oh, and if during this video you find yourself intrigued enough to wanna to take a closer look at the MateBook 13, I will leave links down in the description below. Now let's kick off those top five features starting with the display. As soon as you open this laptop, the screen is the main focus. It features an 88% screen to body ratio with impressively thin bezels. Not only does it have a super high resolution of 2160 by 1440, but Huawei also put an anti-fingerprint oleophobic coating on there as well. Why? because it's also a touchscreen. That's right, the Huawei MateBook 13 allows you to tap and swipe your content thanks to support for 10-point touch, which means it can recognize all 10 of your fingers at one time. Whether you need high pixel density for reading text clearly or a touchscreen display for casual browsing, this screen gives you everything you'd want in a compact package. Up next, let's talk about the portability of the MateBook 13. When you hold it in your hand, you can tell that the Huawei MateBook 13 is built for portability, and that's the second great feature of this laptop. Weighing in at less than three pounds and only 14.9 millimeters thick, this laptop is ideal for easy transportation in the backpack and won't weigh you down. But don't let the weight deceive you because it's not made of cheap material. It's got a nice metallic frame that'll stand up to everyday use. Up next, a feature that Huawei loves talking about on their mobile phones is also available on their notebook, and that is fast charging. Having a portable laptop with a fancy screen is great, but what really matters is keeping that screen powered on. The Huawei MateBook 13 comes with a pocket charger that's more than just a simple charging brick. It can quick charge your laptop and your phone with multifunctional connectors, giving you two and a half hours of battery life from just 15 minutes of charge. Up next, let's talk about the shark fin design. Now you're not gonna see this anywhere on the MateBook 13, but that's because it's actually on the inside. You see inside the MateBook 13 is a lightning fast processor that generates heat and it's critical for laptops to be cooled properly so you can continue your task without the processor being throttled down. Huawei's Sharkfin 2.0 fan design dissipates heat faster than normal by using a dual fan system. The fans function 25% faster than conventional laptop fans, allowing the notebook to be cooled efficiently and your tasks to be uninterrupted. And last but not least on the top five features of the Huawei MateBook 13, Dolby Atmos audio. When you plug headphones into the 3.5 millimeter jack, Dolby Atmos is supported and will create an amazing headphone experience while gaming or watching movies. Dolby Atmos is sort of like simulated surround sound where each object has its own space in the sound stage. I've actually got a True Atmos setup here behind me and having it built into devices with a headphone jack is the next best thing. It creates an immersive experience while working with any set of headphones that you plug in. Since this laptop is fit for travel, you can take it on road trips or plane rides and have the best movie viewing experience possible. Now the MateBook 13 is a fantastic computer for everyday users, but there are a couple of drawbacks as well that I wanted to go through quickly. First, battery life I would say is average. So I'm glad that they packed in fast charging in the first place, because if it didn't have that, you'd be reaching for your charger a lot more often. Also, there's only two USB-C ports and they're not equal in function. The left one is the only port that supports charging while the one on the right supports data transfer and display port output. And by the way, neither of the USB-C ports support Thunderbolt 3 speeds. That said, overall for the price, Huawei's MateBook 13 does pack a punch. It's definitely focused on casual gamers looking to dabble in some gaming or graphic design. It's also a perfect fit for anyone who values a light laptop that's easy to move around. You can pick one up right now with the standard model costing $999, or you can pay $1299 for the upgraded signature model. Now I wanna hear from you guys. What do you think of Huawei's MateBook 13? What's your favorite feature? Drop a comment down below. I'll meet you there for further discussion. By the way, if you missed all the Samsung Galaxy S10, S10 Plus, and S10e coverage, don't miss it. I will leave a card here for you to click on, along with links down in the description below. Thanks so much for watching as always, guys. I appreciate your support. I'm Andrew Edwards, and I will catch you in the next video.